going to have to interrupt you there. We've just heard news of a dramatic incident. The Queen and John Major have had a fight. It's believed to have happened during the Prime Minister's weekly meeting at Buckingham Palace. On the big screen now is our correspondent, Jennifer Gumpertz. The Prime Minister's weekly meeting normally lasts an hour, but today he was seen to leave hurriedly after just 17 minutes. It's clear that a strong disagreement took place, a disagreement which may have involved physical violence. Some palace staff said they heard loud swearing voices and the sound of bodies falling against furniture. One said he saw Mr Major emerge with a red mark across his face and bleeding legs. Seconds after the Prime Minister's departure, the Queen's doctor arrived at speed and ran inside. Neither the palace nor Downing Street have issued an official statement so far. And a few moments ago we received this amateur video footage which seems to show that the Queen and John Major were involved in some kind of drubbing incident. And as a result of that broadcast, the crisis has deepened dramatically. I'm joined by our crisis correspondent, Spartacus Mills. Spartacus, this is huge history happening, it, isn't it? It's bigger than that, Chris. It's large. I mean, if you've got a history book at home, take it out, throw it in the bin. It's worthless. The history books now will have to be rewritten. What will they say? They'll quite simply say, John Major punched the Queen. Everything else will be a footnote. A push for time. Can you sum it up in a word? No. A sound? Uh. Spartacus, thank you.